I'm Kevin Harlan along with Greg Anthony and Brent Berry, our terrific analysts, and David Aldridge is our sideline reporter. And right now for the Bucks, they'd like to start this road trip off on a positive note. You know, it's been a struggle on the road for this team, and they're beginning another road trip here tonight. Now here's Beal. Here's Bull. No good on that one. Great D that time for Middleton. And what a stretch it's been, Brent, for this Milwaukee franchise. All started by the drafting of Giannis Antetokounmpo. Well, just identifying him is one thing, Kevin. you got to also acknowledge the work that Giannis has put in. After that, they have done a great job of building around him. Had that not been the case in Milwaukee, you have to wonder whether he would have re-upped and signed that extension with the Bucks to continue his career here. And what would have happened in free agency? Oh, and out of the combo, hammers it in. The assist. Nice find by Lillard. He deserves some recognition for that kind of pass. Beal deciding where to go with it. And the rebound goes to Lopez. Man, I thought he was making that in so close. That's some aggressive defense. And the shot is good. Onda DeCumbo's got his second bucket of the game to go. Bit of a picture-perfect start here to this game. They've connected on all three looks. Durant in the corner. Down the scoring column with that bucket. One for two this game. And maybe a deep breath moment for them. They're now one for four to start the game. Pass to Lopez. And stolen by Bull. On the wing, Booker. Here in the first quarter with about two minutes gone by. Here's Nurkic. Off to a good start as he hits his first shot attempt. Just another part of Devin Booker's amazing offensive game. He finds wide open guys. This can make it so much easier for your teammate when you throw that lead pass that gets to him right on the money, whether that's on the run or in the shooting pocket. Now here's Booker. 23 points his last outing. Beal drives in. Outside for Durant. Way on the clock. That's good. And so Beal with the assist. And this late in the season, great, you consider rookies to even be rookies anymore. They've played so many games at this point. I mean, yes and no. Uh, they aren't as green as they were to start the season, but rookies still need a full year to fully kind of learn what it takes day in and day out. Kevin Durant after the miss three from Damian Lillard. The drive by KD. And here's the best way to get an earful from your coach. Give Kevin Durant that kind of path to the basket. Wow, discussion to follow. Nice ball movement by Noah. Stolen by Durant for the finish. And the jam by Kevin Durant. And that's up-tempo basketball at its best. So much easier to operate in the open court when a steal triggers the break. Outside, out of the Kumbo. Pass to Lillard. Beal with the steal. A finish. And then Durant with the dunk. And Beal with the pocket pick. When we talk about Bradley Beal, still a phenomenal player, but someone who's getting older. Yeah, no doubt Bradley Beal, Greg, is a veteran in this league now and a guy that wants to compete for titles. So along with staying healthy, Bradley Beal is looking for something bigger. And he just dangles from the bucket after sending that one through. And you can see which team has the swagger right now. And Milwaukee calls their first time out of the game. Bucks trailed by six. And stolen by Booker. And Katie throws it down. Yeah, pull out your dictionary, look up the term pure scorer. You might see a picture of one Kevin Durant. 
Nurkic with the double team. Kicks it out to Lillard. Beasley inside. Back to Portis. Shot clock at five. Here's Lillard. And he makes good on the layup. And Dame Lillard with tremendous concentration there. There's 31 seconds left here in the first quarter. And here's Booker. Still without a basket. Can't get it to fall. Stolen by Durant. And the Suns call their first time out of the game. This game coming after a loss against the Bucks. Yeah, they came into that game a little flat for whatever reason and just couldn't tap into the energy you need to compete. Yeah, and that score got a little bit lopsided, so not the kind of effort that they want to repeat anytime soon. Pass to Beal. To the middle. One second left. And the last shot before the buzzer is off. And so it's Kevin Durant making headlines and highlights for the Phoenix Suns. He totaled 14 points in the... And we return to the second quarter and Noche Latina specialized jerseys on display. Welcome back, everyone. And a moment here to take a look at some of the hustle stats for the Suns. I mean, they've come out aggressive defensively, getting into them and, and coming up with some cookies along the way. Yeah, I wonder if pace and playing fast is something that they're being encouraged to do because right now they feel like the faster team. Down to five on the shot clock. Count it. Portis has got the opening basket here in the second quarter for the Bucks. And Portis can get going at his size. He charged in there and he found himself a look. Right side, Kevin Durant. Second chance effort. Outside for Beal. Buries the long range jumper. Beal's got himself going with the triple, his first basket of the game. And I'm not sure. Bradley Beal has to be somewhere high up on the scouting report, and the defense lost him. So, Greg, when you think about the Phoenix Suns, what do you think fuels them the most? Kevin, I mean, the fact that they had a 2-0 lead in the 21 NBA Finals and lost. This team is really battling to get back to that stage. And if they do, they want to take care of business this time. He has created some terrific opportunities for himself and really made the most of it. Back to Lillard. Let's it go with a three. And Jen shot, and it's Beasley laying it in. Well, for a guy who does a lot of his work on the perimeter, Beasley gets into the painted area. First team foul. Phoenix leading by eight. Booker outside. Right side, Beal. His three pointers off the mark. Left side, out of the Kumbo. Out to the Kumbo using his size! And I like that Giannis slowing down just a little bit in control there. Outside for Durant. And a lot of contact on that one, so he'll shoot two here. And this shows you what a superstar KD is. I mean, the NBA world stopped when that deal was made. Yeah, you just shift the access of the league. Look, you have this elite scorer, this unbelievable all-world talent, and when he gets on a roster, I don't care where it is, all of a sudden you have championship aspirations. First free throw is good. And Greg, when things go crazy, coaches are often the first to go. But how often does that improve things? Sometimes it goes the opposite direction, Kevin. But the simple fact is it's usually easier to change the coach than it is to turn over the roster. They are just killing them on the interior. 
The drive by Booker. Can't connect from short range. Bucks trail by six. And the foul is called. He intentionally grabbed him there for some reason. I don't know. Kevin, Kevin, all I can think of is that he's trying to slow the game down a mm -hmm. little bit. That, right. That's a stretch, though. Definitely a strange move on his part. Pass to Middleton. Fires the three. Wow, through the contact, and that three almost went in. So he'll go to the line for three free throws. Middleton, a talented scorer and a very dogged defender. He's accomplished a lot as a champion and a multi-time also. And Greg, with the coaching changes in Milwaukee, where are they looking for improvement? Oh, Kevin, they, they've been dominant in the regular season, but the playoffs require adjustments. That chess match is where they hope to improve. Count it. Durant's got seven now in this quarter. And KD, so nimble, just a difference maker inside the paint. Portis. And Portis throws it down. What elevation. He's a smaller but still determined big man, and he likes mixing it up with his impressive vert. Pull with it. Now guarded by Middleton. Outside Durant. Pass to Nurkic. And finish off by Nurkic. So dynamic with the ball. Durant showing his versatility with that dish. Over in the corner. Out of the Kumbo. The Bucks working the ball around. Outside Portis. Back to Lillard. Over in the corner, out of the Kumbo. Middleton outside. Milwaukee needs to get off a shot here. And it's Lillard missing. Suns lead by six. And while we've got a moment, let's send it over to our terrific reporter, David Aldridge. David. Thank you, Kevin. Giannis Adentacumbo remains so consistent. He said, I want to get to the position that my game is boring. People don't talk about it because I do it every single night, but I don't get bored. The greats, the best players, never get bored. They always give their best every given night, and that's my mindset. Kevin? Oh, D.A., I love it. Thank you so much for the report. Pass to Booker. Outside for Beal, and Nurkic has it in the corner. Stolen by Middleton. Oh, and here we go. On the Kumbo. Nobody back. And that's an intentional foul. Second personal. Really no idea why you're fouling in a situation like that. You know, maybe there's some bad blood between those two. The shot and game clock separated by four to the inside. Over in the corner, Portis. And another basket for Milwaukee. Yeah, this story in the second quarter much different than the one in the first. We're finally seeing some aggression. Inside. Outside Durant. With four seconds on the clock. Great D that time from Portis. Oh, and he beat it. Did they just do that, Kevin? They just did. Yeah. Oh, beats the buzzer from way down court. These fans are stunned. And as we get into this third quarter, as we've seen so far, neither team able to create much separation on the scoreboard yet. Pass to Middleton for the lead. And Durant sends it back. Durant covering a lot of territory with his length. When you talk about explosive scoring, wow, Devin Booker, Brent, one of the most explosive players of all time. So awesome to watch him when he gets rolling, Kevin, and that can happen in like three seconds. Uh, he's got such a great flow and control of what he can do offensively. Phoenix calls timeout. And as the coaches go to the clipboard to outline their strategy during the timeout, the players getting a chance to rehydrate with some Gatorade. That's key to staying fresh all the way to the final whistle. And Kevin, it really is. And every one of these players knows it. They're all making sure to stay hydrated. It's impossible to play your A game if you're not getting enough to drink, especially uh, towards the end of games when the physical toll of a long contest really starts to add up. Yeah, disappointing not to convert all of them, but he did get the one to give them the lead to the paint. Nurkic with the steal. 
all by himself. On the jam by Kevin Durant. Uh, Nurkic using those active hands and just kick-starting the offense in the fast break. Portis can't get it to go. And so it's KD with it. He brings up the ball for the Phoenix Suns. They host the 76ers after this game. And that will be the middle game of this three-game homestand. Pass to Bull. Outside for Durant. Back to Bull. Over Middleton. And there's the whistle. Three-second violation. And, and those are the kinds of mistakes that are magnified when we're talking about a game down the stretch. Bucks trail by three. On the wing, Giannis. Middleton outside. Pass to Portis. And he hits the jump shot. Eight points for Bobby Portis. And Portis got that shot off really quick. Down low. Nurkic. And finished off by Nurkic. Very little resistance against that throwdown. Nope, not what they want to see in a game this close, Greg. On one side, inspiration. On the other, devastation. Booker with it. Lillard picks him up. At the elbow, Nurkic. Outside, Beal. Six to shoot. Rebounded by the Bucks. I'm not going to see that very often. The defense in the vicinity, but still, he's not one to blow layups. Last season, GA, the Suns trading tons of picks, plus good young players, all for Kevin Durant. And then this summer, trading for Bradley Beal, it's clear they're going all in, constructing a super team to try and bring Phoenix its first NBA title. Looking at the Bucs, GA, they've made the playoffs every year since 2017. And Kevin, as long as Giannis is at the helm, that streak should continue for a while. He's arguably the best player in the world. Guys want to play with this kid. And when you talk about offensive weaponry, Brent, the Suns are loaded. These guys are absolutely scary, Kevin. Night after night, they can come in with guys who can fill it up from anywhere on the floor. So, so hard to stop that kind of potency on the offensive end. When the play breaks down, you go to the talent, and man, they loaded with talent. It's Bull, top of the key. Shoots from 14. No good from Durant. Well, they shouldn't be giving that shot to anyone, but they certainly shouldn't be giving it to him. That's a big break for the defense. Oh, and he went for the two-hander on the slam using some muscle. Some urgency from him there, sure. Here's Booker. Nurkic trying to get open. Misses in close. And even though he didn't get a piece of that shot, you love the pressure he puts on the shooter. Yeah, that's the kind of energy that you want to see on every possession throughout the game. That's just tremendous scoring instinct. So fun to watch him work in the half court. Outside, KD. The Suns need to get a shot off. Here's Beal. He trains it as the shot clock ticks down. Beal's got five. Bradley Beal has been around this league. Great awareness. Pass to Middleton. Back to Lillard. Nice ball movement by Milwaukee. Jacks up a three. And again, Milwaukee with the triple. Yeah, there's six points on consecutive three balls. They're finding holes now in the D. Durant. And then Durant with the dunk. A good heads up from Bradley Beal to spots the ready shooter. Middleton left side. Lillard outside. Off target from outside. Teammates right now covering up for the type of off performance he's having. In terms of scoring, this has not been his best night. Left side Durant. There's Peel with the three. Wow, came this close to a four-point play. He'll head to the line for three free throws. Second team foul. It goes on Giannis Antetokounmpo. Phoenix calls timeout. Three 
Throw good, Beal. Talking about Bradley Beal, Greg, I feel like he doesn't get enough credit for his passing game. You know, Kevin, he's really evolved as a playmaker over the years. Sure, we, we all know how talented a scorer and shooter he is, but Bradley is now superb at facilitating. Hey, Brent, the foundation of the Bucks' success has been their defense. Wouldn't you agree? Yeah, absolutely, Kevin. They continue to dominate in the paint, but they've also made tremendous strides in how they guard the three-point line, just doing a much better job of getting out there and contesting the three. Inside. And he makes the bucket, gets the whistle, and now a three-point play chance here for him. And of the last six baskets, five have come on the interior. This is just smash mouth physical basketball, guys. Phoenix calls timeout. You said it, nothing. One shot. Phoenix, timeout. Attention, fans. Now on the court is your hype squad. Get loud and let them hear it. That was your Suns dancers dance team, everyone. Get loud for them once again. Nurkic is focused on trying to make the job of his teammates easier. He works so hard on the glass and setting screens. Tons of dirty work that Nurkic finds himself involved in. Over in the corner, onto the Kumbo. Goes up and lays it nice Giannis and easy. Giannis has got nine points now in the quarter. They didn't have much of a problem getting the ball into the post that time. Giannis on the Kumbo. He's feeling it tonight and has been the driving force. For well, this has been a great contest so far, and I imagine the fourth quarter could have even more action in store for us. The Suns trailing. Booker looking around. And Cooper throws it down. And how about Booker going high up for the dunk? Here's onto Takumbo. Giannis with a nice hole. That's an excellent play call to free him up from the defense. Well, taking advantage of that opportunity it does not get any more high percentage than that one. Big hops from the backcourt. Oh, absolutely. And maybe just what they need to get this game GA going in their direction. Defense has got to be better. Flat out effort was not there. Kicks it down to Middleton. There's the three. And another three for Milwaukee. Three point field goal. Yeah, those are starting to add up, guys. Up their last five baskets, three have been tripled. The drive by Booker. And the jump by Booker. Booker sometimes can come up with those. He could be an impressive dunker. Here's Giannis. And again, it's Milwaukee converted. This whole second half, he's been unbelievable scoring the basketball. The defense has had literally no effect. Here's Booker. Got a hand on it. And how about the reach from Portis there? And they haven't been able to turn it into a big lead, but their rebound and advantage is starting to add up. And just tacks a few more points onto their lead with the Tomahawk. Ah, that's bringing it down hard. Has to Beal. On the wing, Booker. There's Nurkic. Defended by Portis. Lillard with the rebound. Milwaukee leading by five. The three. Good, and the assist goes to Middleton. And he's now got the double-double. 11 points and 10 assists. Outside, Beal. To the middle. Here's Booker. And he drops it in from the low post. 
Booker's got nine points now in just the second half. The shot by Lillard, wide open. And another three for Milwaukee. Well, and this has been their strategy throughout the fourth period. We'll see how it pans out. It's one thing to have teams shoot a bunch of threes, but with this team being that hot defensively, you got to chase them away from anywhere near that line. And the double up on the Dekumbo. From past the arc, and Damian Lillard, another three. Lillard's got the lead back up to nine now for the Bucks. Pass to Bull. There's Beal with the three. The rebound by Middleton. And here's Middleton bringing it up now for Milwaukee. And that one's good by Giannis. Andre the Kumbo's got six points in the quarter. Only a few big guys in this league that can score at will. Giannis is one of them. Beal with it to the inside. Here's Nurkic. The shot, no good. Good D by Lopez. Bucks leading by 11. From deep, Giannis. Giannis on the And another three from... 